I bought new clippers in the mail. Not actually clippers, just guides. Um, I don't like my hair too long on the top. I actually don't really like having long hair, and that's why having this stupid mullet thing is kind of a cool thing. Because it's like having long hair, but not even having it at the same time. I don't know how to describe it. You just kind of have to have one to understand it. But, um, bought new size 12 clippers in the mail, and they're awesome. Comes at an inch and a half versus the eighth. Uh, eight size eight inch. So I don't know. Looks kind of dumb now, but I'm pretty sure in a good, like a good week, it will look better than how I had it before. But enough about my stupid hair. By the way, I think my hair is retarded. I don't know why I have it. Um, I don't know if you guys are in, into this, but UKF Dubstep is one of the biggest music channels on YouTube, and they basically just post. Dubstep tracks. Like for the last six months, they have totally sucked. I don't think they post a single track I've like. Mainly just because I'm not really into dubstep as much as I was. I'm, I'm much more into U uh, UKF's drum and bass, which slays the dubstep. But anyways, so I'm more of a fan of the drum and bass, and the drum and bass always trains out good tunes, but I have to say, this is a good song. <laughs> Although, I don't really like the wobbles in the song. I'm just not, lately I'm not a big fan of, of wobbles, but just that... <laughs> So, just I wanted to say that that was the first track I've liked in like six months. Although they did post a Feed Me remix in March somewhere. Who the hell was it? Oh yeah, Kaya Girlfriend. That was literally so awesome. So that song was sick. But that's just my little rant on UK after, I mean, dubstep. I'm just not a fan of it recently. I'm still subscribed because sometimes they post good tunes and it's nice to see what is popular with the kids. Um, I don't know, bouncing, I'm, I'm hoping what is the final I Lay Dying remix. Uh, now that I upgraded my RAM, I can now <laughs> finally edit it. Uh, I'm just trying to make it more of the actual song versus more of my style. Try and make it more as like dying and less big chocolate than the past edits because I don't think the average as like dying fan will understand it as well as the average big chocolate fan will. And um, yeah, everyone agrees on that. All the guys in as like dying agree. They all like the track. They just wish it was more as like dying ish. So I'm making it more as like dying ish. <laughs> System overload. I switched to dubstep right at the break. I don't know if I showed it before, but the whole song is drum and bass except for that part. Ah, crunchy noises, leave me alone, and then the outro is kind of cool. I'm pretty happy with it. I'm um, gonna send it off to everybody and see how everyone else likes it. Hopefully, they say, That's great! Sounds good. Send us the wave. Congratulations, it's done! And then I can continue working on more commissioner stuff. Alright, guys, so just working on my bass patches some mo. Um, right now, I've, I've, I'm working on this one Electro song, which is the first song I've actually started on the EP. I'm gonna bring Lisa in to do some uh, vocal hook and then hopefully do some more vocals bits and pieces throughout the actual drop, but check out this part. This is, uh, skipping this whole part. Ah. So, as of now, I think in these, two, these eight bars right here, I want to do some vocals. 
carry the vocals on through here, do some heavy modulation to the build, and then just drop it up in there. Clapping part, you know what I mean, for that live action. Probably some more effects right here. And this is just me working on just furthering, just playing around with my, my new um, <laughs> triple air bass lines, uh, and then double sampled, and then resampled into another program, and then just a huge complicated mess that I'll explain later. So, I don't know. <laughs> I look like an idiot right now. Yep, this haircut's look freaking retarded. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do about it, cause I'm kinda, there's no undo button for haircuts in real life, you know what I mean? I guess I can do like a devil lock. Cause that'll be sick, that'll be sick gnar. Um, I don't know, I kinda screwed up. But hey, we'll see how it looks in a few days. Um, and then if we look at the wavelength, also I got a <laughs> I got a comment saying, "Is this a VST?" No, this is what you used to DJ in, but I used to to look at stuff. <laughs> So what I'm noticing is that bass is lacking bass, and that will be easily fixed with a sub bass. Um, also uploaded those Asking Alexandria remix to my SoundCloud. I noticed that the Asking Alexandria releases, a few of them got released in stores last week on their newest release. I also put this in there. Look, it has seven plays. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna go see a movie. Okay, bye. We just saw that movie Arthur, Molly and I, and I gave it an A plus. I'm completely obsessed with it, and you're probably wondering why I'm talking about this. Cruising through <laughs> Levi's. <laughs> Do you like how I'm zooming on that, Marley? I'm in some fun. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Anyways, I gave it an A hundred plus. Um, now I'm in Kohl's shopping for jackets and stuff. Shopper tip. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I was originally brought this this video camera to film that. Cause I remember. <laughs> so dumb. Um, but um, shopping tip is you should always buy winter gear in spring because it's like these are marked down like eighty percent. Which if you're a deal shopper like me, um, this is what you would do. All of this section's pretty whack. Yeah, it's sick. Is this Justin Bieber? Get me out of here. <laughs> don't film me eating. Why? Because I don't like it. Who can name what that is? I you have five seconds. It's chicken parmesan. I love chicken parmesan. It's one of my favorite dishes. It's like... It's a giant chicken strip, deep fried, put cheese on it, put it on some pasta. Doesn't that sound amazing? It is.